may contain content parents may find unsuitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. Greetings, and welcome to another episode of Cold Sept Revolt. This is Kepitaru. I am hunger. Hear me roar. Rare. <laughs> 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 so we're going to be doing yet another episode uh, with a Let's Play. Let's go ahead and get it started in here. Yes, we've been doing a little bit of grinding. It's okay. It's just a little bit. <laughs> so The reason for revenge is our next stop, apparently. Yes, looks like a fun place to go. Yeah. Because there's always a good reason for revenge. Right. Just to uh, get that revenge going. Hmm. Hmm. I sense a presence. Someone's coming. Hmm. I see. I'm beginning to understand the security protocols in this district. I want to check the, out the North Highway, too, but I'll do that tomorrow. Psych, what are you doing? Kepitaru, what? I'm taking this chance to scout the Count's army. What happened again was unfortunate, but we can't always dwell on sadness. For our comrades sacrificed a matter, I need to investigate as much as I can and defeat the Count. I suppose so. But Psyche, you're covered in mud. Oh, my clothes? Well, investigating is dirty work, so it's unavoidable. Information is our lifeline. I have to retrieve it, even if it means wading through the mud. You're really diligent. While everyone else is thinking about escaping, you're still gathering info to fight the Count. Is there a reason you're so set on fighting him? Sort of, yes. What happened? Does it really matter? It's a stupid reason. Someone precious was taken away from me. An irreplaceable person. So it's for revenge. Yeah, without accurate information, you can't even protect a single person. That's true, if we had more information. Your precious person and Alicia probably wouldn't have died. Alicia, yeah, you're right. Alicia probably wouldn't have died. Hmm. N nothing. Anyway, Kepitaru, would you spar with me a bit? I spent so long scouting that I couldn't do any training until now. If you're going to be my partner, Kepitaru, it should be a good workout. Sparring, huh? Got it. I want to get stronger and help out the free bats, too. All right, then let's begin. Oh boy. Really? Does this one have the time loot on it? Because that's going to be terrible. Doesn't look like it. Or, di or does it? I don't know. I can't tell if this has the time loot or not. Neither can I. This map, though. No holding back. This won't be... Hmm. Really? This won't be in good training if you do. Ugh. Get him. Advance to the next gate. Oh my. Oh, Peter. gonna need one spirit walk today. Let's see if we regret this decision later. This map's a pain in the deck. You're just saying that because I kicked you in the deck. No. I'm saying this because this map is a pain in the deck. Just like I said. Stop drain magic in me, you ass! Motherfucker. He used drain magic. It was annoying. Crap! He's got scrolls! I don't like scrolls! 
I don't like scrolls either. They're too scrolly. Really? God damn it. my two chain so I can drop the damn Rehab that I started the game with. There we go. He had a chilling blast so I went ahead and relieved him of it. Yes, that is the scroll that I was referring to. Yep. Uh, he still has it in mind. Yeah, yeah, I went ahead and shattered that. It was it was, a, it was a good thing to do. To I was like, you don't need that. Mm. I'm thinking I'm only going to need one form portal this game. I hope. Oh, no. Can I get me a Kelpie, please? I went to go and use uh, Metamorphosis on him. Uh huh. And his hand had two storm shields in it, and then I realized, oh crap, if I use that on his storm shields, it'll affect mine too. Yes, yes, it So, will. I had to cancel it, so I basically just discarded two cards for nothing. Lovely. At least I did, at least I realized before. Yeah. <laughs> well, I got yeah. my five chain of blue. Oh my gosh. Oh, the power. Here it comes. Hey yeah. Give me money. I just got him to waste. He's a got a lot anyway. of stuff that I just recently got with the unlocks that I had done. Right. This is not good. <laughs> oh fuck you! He just put paralysis on my Kelpie because he's a dick. Oh man, this guy's being an ass. What the fuck? He's got a really good deck. It's a lot of good synergy cards. Oh, Kieran is so scatty. He put he, he put paralysis on my Kelpie, so I had to switch it with a different Kelpie. It was terrible. Well, oh my God. I mean, I've got a, I, I've got plenty of stuff on the field now. If I can get a Kelpie, I'll be good. Right. I just wish he'd stop putting douchey little starfish everywhere. Oh, the echinoderms? Yeah. yeah. Those are really good because they regenerate. Uh-huh. Well, he's got one right next to my Kelpie, so it's, it's, it's upsetting me because I feel like he's just going to keep moving it and having it attack my Kelpie. Yeah, well, like, that that just, is... Just to piss me off. <laughs> that is kind of one of the things that he can do. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Right now. Use this spell. Mm. The thing is, I don't know what I want to level up, so I'm just going to go ahead and level that to level three. I just metamorphed his, holy, his uh, chilling blasts into Holy Word 6. Nice. That is actually a really good idea. I should probably put some metamorphs in just so I can target scrolls. I mean, it's 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 really good. When you can when they have a scroll that you can target, it's fantastic. 
I play I play a deck with no scrolls, and I just use ch uh, Chilling Blast, or I just use uh, Metamorphosis to change my opponent's scrolls into fucking useless Holy Word Six. Yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah. Let's see, I want greed. I want greed. No, I, I want to save it until he puts an enchantment on, so I don't have to keep uh, switching out kelpies. I keep thinking, oh, do I want to do I want to do this or not? Oh, here we go. Territory. There we go. It's a Kelpie on a level 5 land. Do you think he'll like it? I hope he likes it. <laughs> I, I'd hate for him to land there and just be really upset, you know? I know. That would just you hate be awful. when they call you names because they land on your Kelpies. Right? I'm just trying to play a fun game that everyone can enjoy, okay? Hmm. What should I do here? Uh, I guess just wait. I don't know. See, I just need a Kelpie. Is that a wind shift? Oh, oh never mind. Uh, the thing is, like, we're on round 14, so it's, we start with six cards in hand. We've drawn 14 cards, so I'm, like, 40% of the way through this deck. Oh, you haven't got a Kelpie yet? Yeah. Crazy. Oh, there we go. I've got two. I've only played I one. I just but... got a Kelpie. Oh, hey. I'm gonna draw a spell. Take that. Hiya! Okay, where is Fogface? He's right there. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and exchange this spot with the Kelpie. The right and discard. I would like for him to land on my Kelpie again. That would make me very happy. I would be such a happy boy. Oh, snaps. Here we go. Discard your cards. It's your turn. Hey. Hey, that's my Triton. Hey. Hey, don't you do that. Oh. This is so annoying. He just killed my Triton with a gremlin because it was a gremlin. Fucking hate that. Okay, I'm really worried right now because he's right next to my Kelpie. He has a chilling blast in hand. Uh huh. <laughs> so it's time to go ahead and form portal. There we go. There we go. Just dump that. Okay. Here we go. Alright, he's gonna stop on my Kelpie. It's gonna be great. So he got stopped by my Kelpie. And he is leveling up a territory. Yeah, he's doing that to me too. That is a good play, Senor. Yeah. But you're just the best at this game, the way you level up your stuff instead of ferociously trying to defend your assets against my Kelpie. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Ooh. I'm gonna do this. Hey Alright, here we go. Wait for it. Restore. I just played my second Kelpie right next to the bridge. Nice. And then I played a restore on it. <laughs> and uh, he just landed on my other Kelpie. So I Very has, nice. I has like a whole bunch of mana. So I went ahead and just uh, leveled that land up to level five. <laughs> and it was a water elemental land to start with. <laughs> Well, I'm I'm leveling up the Kelpie one stage at a time because I used dominant growth on him. Uh huh. Right. It's so dominant. 
Did you, did you decide? But, yeah, we're on round 20, so... I'm on round 19. I don't know if I'm going to make it to round 20. <laughs> oh, no, I made it. I made it. Never mind. There we go. Now I'm at goal. I leveled up the land with my uh, Triton on it. And, oh, and he landed on my Kelpie again. Sad face. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna switch out the starfish. Oh no, he's got a Kieran. Help. Oh, he, he, he's dream magicing me. Oh no. He took a hundred mana. <laughs> Psych is in the hole. <laughs> this is really bad. He's gonna have to give up all his creatures. That's just all there is to it. He's still at negative 588. Nice. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, sir. It's one of those, oh, I'm going to have to pay 20 to this Kirin? What a shame. I didn't have to pay anything to anyone. It was amazing. I played another Cornfolk. Just Cornfolk. I love Cornfolk because they're either guarding a territory for you or they're uh, giving you mana. <laughs> The only bad part about them is when you're playing in the uh, two-player game and your partner is like, ooh, I should level up that territory with the corn folk on it. And you're like, what? <laughs> right? like, yeah, it's please sweet. use your mana to level up actual territories with good defenders on them. <laughs> yeah. Please stop leveling up my stupid corn folk that are just there to die. <laughs> And he's been depleted again. We're just going to have to move all the way back to the beginning. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that, that Kelpie with the dominant growth is now uh, on a level 4 territory with 90 base HP. Okay, I finished with 14,598. I think I'm good. <laughs> I I win. <laughs> All right. So what are we doing over here? Oh, look at that. Hey. Oh, there's the goal right there. You've earned a thing. Well, this is about to be hilarious. Territory. What do we got over here? What are we, what are we doing? Oh, we got 462 available. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and train change this. That's why I play water shifts in my deck. <laughs> okay, the thing is, I was doing that more for the bonus to base right. HP than... Yeah, I know. Whee! Oh, nice and powerful. Yeah. Man. And he's like, magic shift! Oh, oh no. Cool. Oh, no. And to spell war. I was gonna land now. Nah, give me a thousand mana. Give me your money. Oh, he's, he's gonna ninja he's you. He's gonna scroll. Uh, yeah. Get that. Get get that rubber armor out. <laughs> na 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 na. Nin ninja ninja ninja. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, hey, you don't need that, right? I can't do anything. <laughs> it sounds like a five-year-old online raging about it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's beautiful. Hmm. I'm glad that they introduced a forfeit button. I just think that when you're playing against an AI, if you if you forfeit, it should just automatically just bounce you to the menu. Without having to go through like okay, so he's got <laughs> three, four, f five, uh -huh. six territories for that chilling blast. Uh huh. So I don't really want to level this up when he still has the ninja, and that would be ninety, and it would just be bad. Uh huh. However. 
Now, my oh, stuff grows ever stronger. Oh, you drew drain magic. Mr. Oh, Mr. I'm okay with that. Mr. Steel, your mana. He's gonna go for it. Yeah, see, here he's like, oh, I'm gonna steal this level one territory. Yeah. You're gonna, you're gonna help a Kelpie out? Should, should I go ahead and do this just in case he doesn't use the scroll? I would. Or is it a safe bet that he's using the scroll? I would use it anyway, just just, just cause. I mean. Yeah, I was, I was pretty confident he was gonna use that scroll. Yeah. Cause that's yeah. gonna be 90 right there. Yep, called it. Wow, just barely, huh? Yeah. Yeah. That's okay though. Because it got the ninja out of his hand and the scroll out of his hand. Right. Well, if you had if you had leveled up to the territory a little bit, though. no, wait, no, that's right. Scroll the, yeah, the scroll yeah. ignores it. Right, right, right. Never mind. Yeah. So it's a good thing. Yeah, it's a good thing that I didn't, that level, didn't level it up because because then he would be stealing a high level territory. Yes. Yeah. It sucks though because because you lost a kelpie. Yeah, but I'd rather lose a level one kelpie than a right. than a level five. I mean, I'm just saying. Discard a thing. Mm. <laughs> Decisions. You should have spirit walked the Kelpie and then moved it. <laughs> yeah, I could have done that. But I, I wanted to get the chilling blast out of his hand. Yeah, that, that would have been the play right there. And right course, here. Yeah, you still have that other Kelpie, though. I mean, not, not, you know, not for nothing, but there's a Kelpie right there. I look, it's a Kelpie that now, that can now receive terrain commands. It's it's so precious. And then, I land and then you land on the freaking fort anyway. I hate that. I do that all the time. I'll be like, okay, I gotta restore this thing so I can use territory commands on it. Well, <laughs> oh, watch it paralyze the Kelpie. Oh, he no, he paralyzes <laughs> the thing. That's behind him. <laughs> well, that you, is like the greatest. You gotta love how intelligent this is. And then he lands on the other one. Oh. Oh my gosh. The face palm uh, I'm is at real. goal, so I mean. Oh, nice. Okay. Face palm is real here. It's your turn. Wow. I just completely um, mopped the floor with this guy. <laughs> I'm sorry that you're still working on it. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that. <laughs> 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 what the heck? <laughs> I just felt like doing that because it's funny. Just as... You've been hit by, you've been struck by a smooth criminal. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Decisions. You don't really have to do anything. I know. You just sort of, you know. Oh, you know what you should do? You should start up. No, no, you should switch out the, the jello wall in your hand for the one that's paralyzed. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> just, so, just so you don't have a paralyzed jello wall. What would Bill Cosby think if you let your jello stay paralyzed, okay? <laughs> nobody cares what Bill Cosby thinks. I know nobody cares what he thinks, but I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, he'd probably think it was time to rape somebody, but still. I mean... <laughs> well, that's game. Hey! I lost, but that was good training. However, after fighting you just now, you've improved remarkably, Kepitaru. It's hard to believe there was a time when you were ever a beginner. All it took was a lot of mistakes and practice. Not so much on the mistakes things. Practice, huh? You might be right about that, but... Hey, Kepitaru, are you sure you don't remember anything? Judging by how strong of a scepter you are, it's hard to think that you got they with, that way with ju just practice. Bleh. Sorry, but I can't remember anything. I don't remember, and no, nobody in the city remembers me either. I can't do anything about that. I see. Well, it can't be helped if you don't know. But to have a scepter like Kepitaro on our side and not... Hmm. Seems like a waste. Psych, what are you mumbling about? It's already been decided, but uh, I'm going to call him over. Wait for me, Kepitaro. I'll be right back. Sure. Call who over? I wonder who he went to call over. Even so, I guess I got a reason for his obsession with fighting the Count. A precious person in revenge, huh? Mm. Uh, 
Alright. Yay! More GP! Ooh, more PP! Psych unlocked! Yeah. Oh. It's about time that we unlocked Psych. Right, well. But, alright, well, it's been fun, y'all. I hope you have an excellent day, week, month of your life. Peace out, homies. <laughs>